Adam and Eve. After creating the whole world, God looked around and was very happy. It was an incredible world filled with wonderful animals, plants, and included two very special people, a man and a woman. God made a beautiful place for the man and woman to live, an amazing garden. God named the man Adam and the woman Eve. God said to Adam and Eve, I need someone to help me take care of this beautiful world. Will you help me? Adam and Eve said, of course, we'd love to help you, God. There were so many trees and flowers and animals of all shapes and sizes that God had placed in the garden. But one of the animals that God created was very tricky, the serpent. The serpent was clever and sly and up to no good. Did God really say you can't eat the fruit from the trees in the garden? No, said Eve. God said we can eat fruit from any of the trees in the garden except for the tree in the middle. God said not to eat from that one, not even to touch it. The serpent smiled a sneaky little smile. God doesn't want you to eat fruit from that tree because if you do, you'll know everything. You'll be just like God, the serpent hissed in his sly way. Eve looked at the tree in the middle and ate some of the fruit and she gave some to Adam too. As soon as they ate the fruit, everything changed. Adam and Eve became very embarrassed and shy. They sewed some leaves together, making some pretend clothes to try to cover up their bodies. They stood nervously behind some bushes. Then they heard God walking around in the garden. God called out to them, where are you? Adam and Eve hid. Where did you go? Called God. Adam peeked out from behind some vines. He said, I heard you and I was afraid. Why were you afraid? Asked God. Well, I'm embarrassed, so I hid. I see, God replied. Who told you that you were embarrassed? Adam said nothing. Did you eat fruit from the tree I told you not to eat from? Asked God. Eve gave it to me, Adam blurted out. The serpent made me, exclaimed Eve. He tricked me. God sighed. I told you not to eat from that tree. Because you have done what I told you not to do, life will be difficult for you now. You will have to leave this beautiful garden and work very hard to get the things you need. Now you will know what it is to be unhappy. God made some real clothes for Adam and Eve and sent them out into the big world. And God was with them everywhere they went.